This is the Robotic Eagles Ultimate Goal Season Control Award submission. Over the season, our team has played around with a variety of techniques and methods to make our robot fast and efficient. And one of the ways that we do this is through our code. To start off, one of our key components is odometry. We implement odometry by placing three dead wheels on the bottom of our robot. By converting their wheel rotations to inches, we know exactly where we are on the field. With this information, we can make precise and autonomous movements from point A to B by calculating our trajectory. We instruct the robot to move to 7070 with the curve strategy at 0.8 speed. We hit start and the robot executes that command. Then from that position, we can tell the robot to now just spin in place so that our heading is zero degrees at 0.3 speed. And finally, we can ask it to go to 2035 with spin and curve strategy at 0.5 speed. Once we create this route, we can save it and replay it if we want. With this capability, we designed a custom-made application which enables us to code our autonomous without having to physically write any code. This is the Bot Routes GUI. As you can see, we have a variety of autonomous programs for both blue and red sides. Once we open up a file, we can see the many steps that make up the autonomous. You can also see the route drawn out on a visual representation of the field on the right. We also have the capability to have different routes depending on which zone case you are going to, such as to zone A, B, or C. And you can see how the route changes for each one. Opening up a step, you can see the many customization options that we have. We can dictate the condition for the step to execute based on what zone we detect. We can also add delays here. We can pair a bot action with the move, such as turn on shooter or close claw. Here we define the movement speed, strategy, and direction for when we use the relative movements. We can also define our heading. Lastly, we define our target position. We also have the option to use a name target, such as get detection result, which takes the position that our image detection algorithm outputs. We also have developed our own image recognition model. This allows us to quickly and accurately determine which zone we need to go to during autonomous. We developed our custom model using Google's Teachable Machine, and to interpret our model, we created our own custom implementation. We use computer vision in other areas as well. In Teleop, to help our drivers, we have a turret angling system. This season, we designed a rotating shooter or turret. This allows our shooter to be angled in any direction. To angle the shooter so that it's always facing forward, we use the camera at the front of our robot and angle it towards the navigation images using Euphoria. Our camera is on a servo so that it turns. Using the servo position of the camera, we can translate it to the angle of the turret. With this, we are easily able to shoot upwards of 30 rings in Teleop alone. The turret also comes in handy while shooting pegs in both autonomous and teleop. With the press of a button, the turret will angle itself to the three pegs and shoot them in less than three seconds. This is a brief overview of our autonomous capabilities. Over the course of the season, we have made multiple tutorials and videos going more into depth on exactly how we use odometry, do custom image recognition, and more in the hopes that other teams could learn and build upon what we have done. Thank you.